Future Ange here who has just finished filming the commentary. I thought I've seen this movie before. I have not seen this movie before. And this whole time I thought I've seen this movie before. I haven't. Don't listen to me. Just don't listen to me in the intro. <laughs> I feel like I still need to be watching Christmas movies because I'm watching this and filming this before Christmas, but this video is for after Christmas. So like, <laughs> it's weird. I've been watching so much Christmas stuff but, and then I now I'm watching not Christmas stuff, but Christmas didn't happen yet. So I'm still should be watching Christmas stuff in my head, but it doesn't work that way in the content world because I'm like 500 steps ahead. We're watching Rush Hour. <laughs> Tis the season, am I right? <laughs> Welcome back! What's up guys, it's Ange, and today we're gonna be watching Rush Hour! It was announced like a week, maybe two weeks ago, that Rush Hour 4 is going to be coming out, and I... am gonna be honest with you. I don't remember anything about this movie. <laughs> Except for that one scene, where it was like that name thing. It's like, I am me and you... you are you, right? That's like the only thing that I can remember from this movie. I watched it so... Dang long ago, which I think is like a disgrace. We have Chris Tucker, I th think is his name. Oh my gosh, that's gonna be so embarrassing if that's not his name. Please edit it out if it's not his name. <coughs> yes, that's his name. Oh, thank God, let's go. I have a good memory. And Jackie Chan, like, I'm so, it's just gonna be a grand old time. This is gonna be really exciting. And I just, I just wanted to watch this ever since that was announced, so I hope you enjoy it with me. This is pretty much a first time watch because this is the first time I'm gonna be watching it as an adult. I think fifth grade, honestly, is when I watched this. So like, there was no way my brain was computing what was going on. So, I'm ready. Have you seen this movie before? Let me know in the comments down below. And also you should leave, just leave a comment because that helps with the algorithm and we're a slave to the algorithm. Before we begin, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. If you haven't yet already, so you can stay tuned to all my content. I post three times a week. If you're not subscribed, please do it. It helps more than you know. I'm almost at 150,000 people. Can you do it for me, pretty please? It would be the world to me. It would be. It would mean so much if you just hit this red button. <laughs> Wow, I sound very desperate today. Follow me on my social media. All my handles will be in the description below. And follow me on Twitch. I live stream every Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday. If you guys want to check out the full-length commentary to this movie, make sure you check out my Patreon page where you can gain full access to that and future movie slash TV shows that I do on this channel. Alrighty, y'all. Let's jump straight into the commentary. I'm excited for this. This was also a different time, so I know that the humor in this is about to be a little bit different, but that's okay. I'm kind of ready for it. <laughs> oh, gosh. Who's getting taken over here? Oh shoot! Oh, that was smooth! Did you see- that was cr- he just yeeted himself into a window all classy like the man, the myth, the legend hiding in some sort of unit. You know what that was? He did the Scott Pilgrim yeet through the window but 10 times cooler. Insert gif of Scott Pilgrim eating out of a window here. You know what? He just left. Then insert Jackie Chan. You know what? He just left. Hey, yo, oh, I'm so ready for Jackie Chan action. Fun fact, he was supposed to be in everything, everywhere, all at once, but he turned it down. Early this evening, Detective Inspector Lee have once and for all crushed the Gentile criminal organization and reclaim artifacts from 5,000 years of China's heritage. Oh, wow, that's amazing. Good, good job. Wow, that's what that was? They were stealing ancients. Oh, they were going to try to sell it and get, but they probably would have made bajillion, bajillions of dollars from that. Yeah, hit him again. That's mean. Student. Student or daughter? <gasps> oh. Yeah, that's the biggest lie I have ever heard in my life. Cue in Chris Tucker. That's actually hilarious. This is how people treat each other in America. 
Road rage alone, man. It's just so much hate in the world. Oh, <gasps> what the heck is that? Is that a bomb? Why y'all messing with us for? Hey, you don't want to do that. Oh, yes, I do. Oh, no, he don't. Obviously, he just played. Yes, he is. Obviously. No, I'm not. Yes, he is. <laughs> Chris Tucker's character, man, is just the king of gaslighting. It's hilarious. Oh, but he's got like a freaking bomb in his trunk. Oh, gosh. Is that not terrifying? I would literally have so much anxiety. Oh, shoot. shoot yes get it dude amazing but also like that's a mess you just have made a mess so young i love you have a nice day okay so Soo young is literally not jackie chan's daughter i've got his name that actor oh my gosh i know him oh shoot la traffic do be real oh. yes girl wait why is she so cute Stop! Free guy! That was like the free guy anthem! Sweet, sweet fantasy, baby! Oh, sh oh, oh my god! Oh my, oh, what is happening? What the F? Yeah, hit him with the bear! Do the eye gouges and the, you know, the things that kicks? Amazing! Yeah! Oh my gosh, that's what happens. Don't mess with the girl trained by Jackie Chan. <gasps> the guy with the bleached hair. That's the guy from the boat. They've got a vendetta. Cut to black. Intense. I love it. But also, oh my gosh. I would like one of my people to help. Damn that, sir, but he's already on the plane. I trust you would treat him with the same courtesy as you have shown me. Yeah, get your man Jackie over here. That's what I'm saying. Call the field office, have him send over a rookie. Follow some leads, show him some sights, keep him out of our way. Well, even if I had an extra man, who would want such a bullshit assignment? Oh, gosh, this is hilarious. And they're gonna assign Chris because he's the, no one probably likes him. I don't even know their actual names yet, to be honest. A 10-year-old daughter of a Chinese diplomat was kidnapped this morning, and they want you on the case. FBI want me? That's right. That's so hilarious. He is telling the truth. They want a rookie. They want someone to BS around, which is what you do best, sir. Okay, boys, what do we got? Have we checked the council personal- Oh gosh, sir, don't pretend you know what you're doing. Come on, we need humility. Oh, humility is, is something you need to learn, bro. Someone's got to kick you in your butt. Lee is a foreign detective. He's a personal friend of the consul. It's your job to keep him out of sight away from danger out of sight away from danger this is an fbi operation i don't need any help from the lapd oh they're telling him the truth okay so the reason they don't want lee is because you're just scared that if something happens to lee it's their fault which i understand but also just like make a contract or something a liability waiver or some ish i don't know it's not that big of a deal but then it doesn't make for a good movie so I guess just ignore me. Oh, but you know, Lee is not gonna not figure out the case. Because one, he's too good. And two, he has a freaking personal attachment to this girl. That's one of his students. You speak in English. Oh, not the accent. But this is hilarious. Understand the words that are coming out of my mouth. <laughs> Yes, Jackie, play him. No, I'm serious, Captain. I ain't playing it. You need to call the FBI and tell them you made a mistake. I do that, Carter. I'm sure that you and- Oh, there. the station is having a grand all time. And you better call the FBI. I'm going to drop his ass off at Panda Express. You're going to drop him off where? Panda Express? At least get him to a better Chinese restaurant. Panda Express is a disgrace. I might know a little something. I don't know nothing about the kidnapping. My dude is buying up all kind of firearms, explosives, and people. Like, I don't know his name. You don't know his name. For $45, I don't know his name. Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. How does this guy know anything about anything, though? You just know everything? How convenient. But I get it. I wish I knew everything. I know almost nothing. Oh, he yes! Get it, dude! Oh my gosh, please play him. It's all right. FBI. Don't, 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 don't. Oh gosh. Yeah, feeding into his ego. Oh shoot, and the pearly whites and everything. <laughs> was the role really necessary? Maybe it was. Wait, that's so slick. He got into a taxi and 
That's crazy. It's my young <laughs> man. Stay in the car. Oh. You have another gun? Why are you holding two guns? Oh my god, the taxi taxi driver has a gun! The taxi driver has a gun! That's hilarious! Uh, I'm a policeman. I'm just showing him how to take a gun from a suspect. Yeah, he knows English. I'm not responsible for your assumption. That's very true. Jackie, your hair looking hella slick right now. Just saying. I like to let people talk. Who like to talk? It makes it easier to find out how full of shit. Yeah, put him in his place, Jackie. This ain't no democracy. Yes, it is. No, it ain't. Yeah, you wish. You actually wish, though. He seems like a person that needs to be in control of every situation, regardless of the situation. Hence how he, like, literally is enforcing the law, even though he's breaking the law because he has power, so he feels like he can do it. I hope his learning curve is great. Yeah! Oh my god, there's no way he just started playing music as he was talking. That's the funniest ish ever. I wouldn't be surprised if someone, like, just do that to me one day. Like, I'll just be talking. All day. That was a horrible shot, dude. I can play pool better than that. You got a prescription for this? Yeah. Where is it? Uh, I, Where is it? I, I live, I live I, 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 <laughs> Not the mumble trick. That's just not my cigarette. This sick of weed. Sick of weed. Oh my gosh, that's that's hilarious. That's so quotable. That's burning. You're gonna burn a hole in your pocket. Is that Nakata? Oh! oh! Ow! My rib cage! My oh, that knocked the wind out of me. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> that's how I feel. That was so unsolicited. I'm just schooling that rookie man, showing him the ropes. Why you come to church, son? I had some things to take care of, but I made a nice service, though. <laughs> Wait, that's so adorable. He goes, why did you come to church Sunday? <laughs> Yo, when they're church homies, that's how you freaking know. They're homies. Don't do this to me, movie. Don't try to make me like this character. This egotistical character. <laughs> the sigaweed. And then the, why didn't you come to... <laughs> Why did you come to church this Sunday? Really getting me on this guy's good side. What's up, my What's up, my <laughs> Oh no, he, poor Jackie Chan just did, well not him. His, poor Lee. Poor Lee just didn't know, man. They're all fully going at war with Jackie Chan. I mean, I get it. But can't you tell he has no idea what he's saying or doing? I said I don't want trouble. That's bad for you. <laughs> it's bad for you. <laughs> Man's finally rolled another one. <laughs> Just for it to get taken away. The one-liners in this? So funny. Hey, what are you doing? You ain't the only one with quick hands, are you? Oh, something's gonna happen while you're away. And he's gonna need to get off those cuffs. Eat the bean burrito! Oh, he just got out of them. Hilarious! You thought a pair of handcuffs was gonna hold back Jackie Chan? He took the wheel. Maybe a pair of handcuffs can take on Jackie Chan. But the steering wheel of a car can't take down Jackie Chan! You don't understand. I was invited. So <laughs> Oh shoot, that was slick. This is what happens when you don't let him get involved. Oh my god, there's no way he's gonna- <laughs> He was looking right at the camera center! That was amazing! He just parkoured the ish out of that wall- He just scaled it! He's a literal spider monkey! Edward Cullen wishes he- Edward Cullen wishes he was Lee! I had to check to make sure my mic wire didn't get cut out. If you guys haven't seen my Frozen commentary, man, I touched my wire for like the sli the slightest little inch and it knocked the whole thing out. If you ever see me looking this way <laughs> during my reactions, it's because I'm checking to make sure the, ca the mic is still recording and it's still on. I think there has been a misunderstanding. I would like you to meet Detective Inspector Lee. Agent Carter has been helping with my investigation. He's upset that we have not done our job. We have everything under control. We're on top of it. We're gonna get your daughter back safe and sound. Oh, he's covering for everyone. He coming around. Hello? Uh, who's this? 
Am I speaking with FBI? The FBI? Yeah, this is the FBI. Oh, is he only gonna get the info? That's hilarious. The drop will be made tonight, 11 p.m. Oh, the amount will be $50 million. do you think you kidnapped Chelsea Clinton? Uh, bro, you're talking to him about my daughter right now. And 10 million in 10. You want any fives with that? What is your name? What's your name, man? You called us. I just want to be able to tell the consul who is responsible for his daughter's death. Hold up, hold up. Calm down, calm down. I'm trying to hook you up, man. I'm on your side, man. <laughs> I'm on your side? Yeah. You can't blame a guy for asking if you want any fives, okay? Jeez, $5 bills, Abe Lincolns, they come in clutch sometimes, okay? When you ask for change, perfect one to give away to get singles back. You know what I'm saying? Like, you must put your men back. They're going to blow the building? There's no- Yeah, you just killed like six of your agents, no? However many people they sent up there. All the scenes with Jackie Chan doing parkour is honestly the best. He got a fun! Oh my gosh! I thought he was gonna fly out of that window. Why you didn't tell me about the bridge? I did. I said stop! I don't understand what you be saying. What? <laughs> you see what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't understand what you'll be saying. What? You see what I'm saying? He did say stop. He fully told you to stop. Stop gaslighting him. But also keep doing it because it's hilarious. Bobby, didn't I turn my back that time when you bought that bag of weed? I was spending it with you. But didn't I give you the bigger half? Sick of weed? I thought weed was bad for you, Carter. <laughs> you want some of this? Because if you do, I'll give you all you want. Give me a name. You may not be directly involved with the girl, but you sold it to a man that will literally harm this little girl and harm many probably other people. I mean, they already killed like six agents. Just tell us a name. Yo, I could be an a uh, off agent, special investigator detective. You kidding me? My interrogation skills on point. Did you hear that? Absolutely nothing. Yes, yeah, sing it. No one kill your vibe. Don't let anyone rain on your parade. <laughs> Look at him dancing! Oh, they're be becoming friends! They're dancing! You know, y'all should be on the job, not gonna lie, but I'm always down for a good dance number. Yes! He's teaching him how to get the gun from the enemy. You did it! Good job! How are we gonna go about getting this guy, June Child? How do we know he even exists? I know. You killed my partner. The reason why I don't have no partner, that's one thing I learned from my daddy. Your dad? My daddy wants to arrest 15 people in one night by himself. Why did he arrest 25 by himself? Oh, they're like battling it out. They're also honoring their dads, which is like so cute. If anything go wrong, you bust in like the LAPD. Yeah, people are not gonna believe me, but okay. This won't work. I'm not 6'1". Yes, it will. I'm not 6'1". <laughs> yeah, that's the issue. That's what's gonna, that's what's gonna get him. But I have already told you, I don't know, Mr. Look, do you think I came down here for nothing? You give me some gas money? You got $5 on you? Would you please go upstairs and tell Mr. Junta to get his ass down here? I wonder if he was allowed to improv his lines. He talks endlessly. He talks so much, but he's so good at it. So why weren't you guys looking at the TV screens before? Or why don't you just have that open? Although that was really cool. Oh my gosh, what are you slipping him? You're gonna roofie Carter? Oh no, Ann Lee? Oh my god, don't, don't, don't do it. Don't do it, no. Oh, how did you get the necklace? Oh, finally we get to see Young. No, no, no. Oh gosh, where are they taking her? What y'all watch? Oh, you didn't see the face. Are y'all so quiet? Because they're about to murder you. I don't know who you're messing with. I'm gonna knock that young. Ow! Bro, your nose Which should be broken. Which one of y'all kicked me? <laughs> Which one of y'all kicked me? He didn't even know where it came from. I mean, cut me loose. Let me go. No, no. I wait for you. That's so funny. Oh my gosh, he dropped it because he's not used to doing that. <gasps> yeah, get drop kicked. We love me a good drop kick. Oh shoot, yeah. Why were they ordering food at this time? You literally just gave Jackie Chan an out. But I'm not complaining. Y'all asked for it, for it, really. 
You ordered spring rolls, but you got the whole... Uh, you got me instead. Yeah, get your necklace back. Where did she even get it? Didn't it drop in the car vehicle? So that means someone would have to pick it up and then give it to you. Why you? You're just a restaurant that's hosting all this ish. Why am I not surprised to find you here, Carter? <clears throat> I want these two back at the consulate immediately. Ooh, y'all are in trouble. I know <laughs> It was all my fault. Did you just bow? You just bowed. Full 90 degrees too. Honestly, that was that was great. Yeah, Alma. I would do whatever they whatever. Oh, that's such a power move. Hanging up in the middle. He took that's John Wick. John Wick took notes. John Wick took notes from this movie. Hanging up mid-sentence is such a power move. Oh my gosh. Excuse me, Consul, you have a guest. Thomas. Oh, no. I'm sorry, my friend. I couldn't stand by and do nothing. What, what do you, oh no, you're do, you're being so trickery. What do you mean stand by and do nothing? Kind of looked a little different in that angle, but I'm pretty sure Thomas is him. I didn't remember his name was Thomas, but it was just a face that I kind of recognized. But now I'm kind of doubting my capabilities. But no, that's him, right? Stand by and do nothing. You're robbing him blind. $70 million and maybe murdering her da his daughter. It's, it's I haven't brought out the elbow. Actually, I have brought out the elbow. I haven't winded up the elbow in so long. Oh, it's, oh he's about to get it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's such a good shot. And panning on the two random guys to the window to see him dilly dallying on that th thing that goes so funny. Whoever decided that shot, 10 out of freaking 10. You say your father is a legend. My father was a legend. My father was killed making a routine traffic stop. My father was just as much devoted as you. And for what? A traffic ticket and some punk? You tell me what's the honor in that? Believe for your father wasted his life. Did he die for nothing? You proved me wrong. Oh, what a pep talk. What an actual pep talk. Yeah, prove me wrong. Oh my gosh, someone give him a mic so he can drop it. My advice to you is pay the money. Yeah, obviously your advice is to him is going to be pay the money because you want the money. You shady son of a snob. You're probably son of a, a snob. Makes sense. So now that it's now that it went from 50 to 70, do you want 20 million in fives? <laughs> ah, so funny. Stop pretending you're nice. Wait a minute, I seen that guy at that Chinese I'm restaurant. Just, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, you have in the camera. Oh my gosh, you did see him. I thought you didn't see him. Just received a threat on the building. Please exit the building as soon as possible. Please do not panic. He said, please don't panic, so they don't panic, and then he instantly ensues panic. <laughs> him casually slipping away because he knows that they're freaking on to him. Jito. Oh my gosh. Jito. Six blocks of C4 are wired to your daughter in a car outside. How did no one notice that the bartender was this bleached hair guy? Just be patient. The transportation will be here shortly. Where are you hiding, Carter? Like, where are you going? Oh, he's gonna save the girl. Carter's gonna save the girl. Hey, hey, man, I was just gonna tell you, it was in the red zone. Yes. <laughs> oh, he did it! You did it! You did the gun taken away thing! Oh, Lee taught you so well! And he was so proud of himself, too! <gasps> oh my gosh, she's literally strapped in so much explosives. If I was her, I'd literally be dying. Thank you. And good night. I got something for you. Oh my gosh. Mama. Okay, it's not is very dangerous. Come on, push the button. Yeah, come on, push the button. Yeah, yeah, do it. Oh my gosh, even the girl is taunting you. Push the goddamn button. Yeah, swear. And she knows how to defuse a bomb now, probably, hopefully. This is a red. I'm so glow. sweet. And so are you. Did you just eeny meeny miny mo that ish? Cause it literally looked like you didn't know what you were doing. Yeah, you wish you can reload as swiftly as- Oh, using it 
as a defense because if they blow it, then you die too. That's actually hilarious. Yes, yeah, save your culture. Oh no, just for the other one to be knocked. <laughs> oh, the priorities are amazing. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, shoot. Doing that all while balancing the freaking thing? Of course. Of course. That's the worst feeling in the world, probably. Oh, gosh. Yo, that was smooth. -er. Let's go, Carter. Oh, my gosh. This is crazy. Was he on wires and like, was he actually doing this on this building? Cause that'd be actually insane. <gasps> yeah, that's what you get. All your money just flying away. <sighs> Would be me too. Would be me too. Like shamelessly. Would be grabbing those bills for myself. <laughs> yes, amazing. Oh gosh. Oh man! Ought to have snapped Ooh, you know you his did. back. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Hang on for about an hour. I'm gonna go get the ambulance. I'll be right back. Carter! I was just playing. <laughs> I'm just playing. There's no time to dilly dally, Carter. Oh my gosh, that's literally crazy. Oh gosh, that's crazy. Oh my gosh, no way that actually saved his life. A banner braced his fall. I can't believe you said, I'm gonna be right back, we'll go get an ambulance. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh. Aww. Oh. What ah. took you so long? I'm sorry, I was dilly dallying around, you know, eating boxes of grease and fighting people from literally every which way. When you come back, there's gonna be an FBI badge waiting for you. You serious? Wait, like literally? I don't know what to say. It's, There's no way. I got an idea though. I got an idea. Take that badge and shove it up your ass. Yeah! Drop the mic! He said, I don't need no FBI. Y'all weren't there for me ever. You know, I ain't been on no vacation in five years. No police work for two weeks. <laughs> oh, he's taking a break. 15 hours. 15 hours? You didn't know the length of your own flight before getting onto the plane? Whoa. Oh, hey. <laughs> I could watch an entire movie of them just sitting on a 15 hour plane ride together. That was rush hour. Okay, I'm gonna be so honest with you. Like, I now realize that the clip and the movie that I saw years and years ago was probably rush hour two or three. It was not this one. I have not seen the first one. And I always thought that the one that I saw was the first rush hour. It wasn't. <laughs> I've never seen this movie before in my life. <laughs> wow, that was so funny. I feel like I didn't even give good commentary. I feel like I was just laughing the whole time and enjoying myself. That's the great thing about this movie is that you can just have a good time. You know, you don't have to overthink or like, you don't have to like dive deep into the movie to try to figure out what's going on. It's just pure entertainment. Definitely saw either Rush Hour 2 or 3, not the one that I thought I saw. And I, I, I'm just blown away. That was so fun. I think this duo is just hilarious and the script was funny. The humor, a lot of it doesn't go through nowadays, but it was still so much fun to watch. I have that in mind while I'm watching this. I hope y'all felt a little nostalgic watching this with me, and I hope y'all are hyped for the fourth one. I'm really curious to see where, how they're going to create a fourth one. Um, not that, you know, they're old or anything, but like, <laughs> old. <laughs> Honestly, even the mere fact of them creating a fourth one is good. It's selling me. I'm gonna watch it. Like, <laughs> honestly, my favorite thing about this was watching Chris Tucker ramble on forever and watching Jackie Chan be wholesome. <laughs> like, that's that's it. Oh, and his parkour. Man, I wish I could parkour like that. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed that commentary, make sure you leave it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't yet already so you can stay tuned to all of my content. And don't forget to check out my last video. If you guys want to check out the full-length commentary to this movie, make sure you check out my Patreon page. We can gain full access to that and future movie slash TV shows that I do on this channel. Alrighty, y'all. Have the bestest day ever, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Okay, bye, okay, bye, okay, bye!